Civil regime, civil regime, regime, civil regime dropped their newest collection, Rose from the Storm, and the way they describe this collection is, even in the darkest and most challenging times, there is budding for growth, resilience, and transformation. Just as a rose can bloom from concrete, we can also rise above and emerge with newfound strength and beauty. And what I notice is they work on several different collections and kind of drop them throughout the year. So it's not something that's on sale all the time, every time. I found this brand about two weeks ago, saw them on Instagram. I'm in the market for graphic oversized tees. And because each item has a finite quantity, like a few hundred, they tend to label them one through I don't know, 500 or something. So I guess there's more of like that limited product aspect of it. So this is my first time, we're gonna check them out. So if you're into graphic tees, oversized tees, this could be it. Let's get into it. This is the bag it came in. So ordered this on, it dropped Sunday, like six or seven Pacific time. So I ordered this Sunday evening and today is Friday. The label was created on Monday, shipped out on Tuesday, I think, and it's Friday. Or shipped out Tuesday or Wednesday, so it got here relatively quick. So that's it for the bag. So I got two shirts in a size large because I want that oversized fit. So here's the first one. Here's the first one, comes in this relatively nice bag. I don't know if you could see that. All right, so we're gonna unzip it. It's supposed to be like distressed style tees. Let's zip the bag. Wow, this is a really, oh shoot really thick collar and it's pretty wide. I don't know how well uh, their returns go, but this is it. Dang, that's like really big actually. Maybe I should have got a medium. So the shirt definitely looks distressed as you can see on the collar. I don't know if it focuses, as you can see collar you can see the distress marks on it it's a thick collar it's about an inch it's about an inch this is the sleeve I don't know if you could see that either yeah it's like distressed on the sleeve the tag ah there we go civil regime I don't know if you can read that part there we go vintage vintage wash the vintage collection achieves its authentic look and feel through special dye and mineral wash processes which create unique and natural variances in texture, distress, and shade. These are intentional and not considered defective. Please take care as the colors may transfer. Wash separately, avoid contact with pale fabric and surfaces, and follow the care instructions. This is the Rider in the Storm 199X Oversized Tea and Vintage Wash. So that's the front. And that's the back. Back side. And there's the label. So let's try this on. I'm gonna put this on over my tee. So, 
It looks, the collar is a little bit wider than I want, but I mean, fits pretty well. It's a lot of room. I love how the sleeves go all the way down. It actually goes like, this is my elbow right here. So it goes pretty low. I like that. Obviously, it's an oversized fit, so there's a lot of room to it. Um, let's see. I don't know if you can notice right here. So, my back pocket is right here. I guess like my, my butt <laughs> goes to like right here. So it goes pretty low, relatively low. Good fit. Definitely get that vintage feel with this shirt. Oh, you can also see the bottom right here. Same thing, like the sleeves. So overall, it's like awkward. <laughs> I need to get down. <laughs> yep. What do you think? All right. not beer by the way, it's water. All right, so. Shirt number two. I don't know why I keep looking in the back. There's nothing in the back. All right, so. Same thing, with the collar, the tag. Same thing with the collar and the tag. Collar is about an inch thick. You see distress marks on the collar. Same thing on the sleeves. I don't think there's as much compared to the other one. Now that I'm looking at this one in particular. Oh yeah. So here it is. There's the front. There's the front. And there's the back. This one looks a little more gray, I think. You got the tag, the vintage wash information, the tag, roses from concrete blooming through chaos. I don't think I showed this in the other one, but as you can see the tag, the civil regime made in Mexico. 100% cotton. Care instructions right there. Ah, okay, it's not focusing, but care instructions are right there. If you want to look at the stitching on the inside, So I'm not gonna wear this with the shirt underneath, but actually I might, I might. It should fit just like the other one. Yeah, so it goes down, same thing, elbows right here. Fits the same, me butt right here. Let me get, get low. Heck yeah. Good wash. Heck yeah, dude. All right, guys. There you have it, Civil Regime. First time checking them out. So as you can see, the numbering is right here. So I got 41. For the first shirt, I got 57. I got 57. So, okay, all right. Top 100, still good. Overall, I think I'm a fan. I like the prints, I like the design, I like the feel of the shirt, the way it's washed, the way it fits. 
And I think I gambled right with the size large because I don't have to return it. And I could just wear it like right now, like all day. So that'll be, everything's good. Except I probably won't hold it when I hold my kids because they tend to be very messy and my baby actually like drools so they'll kind of like eat or whatever and then drool all over me right here when I hold them. So probably not gonna wear this when I'm at home hanging out with the kids but if you see it in photos, I'll probably be wearing this in my videos so check it out. If you like Civil Regime, check out what they have left because I know this stuff sells out pretty quickly. Looks like they have a couple pieces left, like hats, a couple jackets, sweaters, and a couple shirts. So if you're into oversized shirts, right here. Right. Overall, it's a it's a good shirt, and I plan to wear it for until like I'm 80 or something. So graphic tees, graphic. So graphic, oversized tees, vintage wash, vintage look. Check it out, Civil Regime guys. If you like this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up. And if you're in the market for a down jacket, I did a review, an in-depth review of a Canada Goose down jacket, which is probably one of my favorite jackets. So check it out, let me know what you think, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.